प्रोफेसर चौबे सर प्रोफेसर माजी प्रोफेसर मिश्रा फैकल्टी ऑफ ट्रिपल आई टी भागलपुर एंड ऑल द पार्टिसिपेंट्स गुड आफ्टरनून टू वन एंड ऑल लिटिल बिट डिफरेंट टॉपिक्स आई हैव सिलेक्टेड टूडे आई डिस्कस दिस इश्यू विथ चौबे सर एंड यू हैमिटेड my topic is innovation sir research and innovation university is the dream of every top ranking institute in india even it is one of the objectives of the national education policy 2020 to become a research university is a difficult task but to become a innovation university is a comparatively easy goal for the indian economy to become atmanirbhar bharat the innovation culture is the need of the hour every triple it nit iit are trying to achieve this goal by establishing specialized wings of technologies such as data science cyber security and so on but unfortunately the indian higher education system is focusing more on research and not on innovation i have written 600 pages book on this topic namely innovation the growth in the engine for the nation nice buzzword but often misunderstood it is free and e copy can be downloaded from my website today i would like to highlight this issue in my research in my speech so let us see innovation is not a very complicated subject see the seven examples the first one is substitute we know everybody knows about that fountain pen and now everybody is using dot pen so that conversion from fountain pen to dot pen is an innovation we are using daily mobiles just imagine the mobile in 2002 or 2004 it was only button mobile and nowadays we are using cameras and audio and video and even chatting everything is there so that is an innovation so combine the features that is an innovation i'll give one more example radio previously that this was the radio and now we are putting in inserting we are uh, adopting that one in our car so this is an innovation similarly table watch a bigger size table watch is an innovation whereas the smaller size wrist watch is an again innovation we know this scenario we were calling through phones and all and now we are using whatsapp for chatting with 250 uh, audience we can directly contact through this chatting so this is again an innovation now elimination in 2005 or 2002 we have seen this uh, uh, shops greeting cards and now nobody is using that it is an absolute concept so elimination is another way of doing uh, innovation one more example electricity to fan and fan to electricity so rearrangement this could be an innovation innovation is a most widely used word but least understood what is happening that it is not invention it is not discovery it is not creativity or it is even not research and normally we feel that we are doing research means we are innovating something but it is not so most of the time let us see the internet is invention whereas facebook whatsapp is an innovation for invention we have to do i mean enough work laboratories are needed something i mean something great facilities are needed whereas for innovation innovation very simple ideas will work you see this one a bicycle old age bicycle 100 years back that was the invention whereas today's bicycle is an innovation we are adding more facilities to it 
we are aware of this. All gadgets, I mean, uh, ICs, register, capacitors, IC chips, and etc., etc. This is an invention. Whereas uh, your iPod, your mobile, we are using this uh, electronic circuits and devices, and we are combining it together, and we are developing mobile. So that is an innovation. Now this is the list of you know, in, in discoveries, invention, and innovation. X-ray is a invention, whereas medical X-ray is an innovation. Little efforts are required for converting discovery or invention to innovation. Sometimes it's a very very easy. Light sensitivity of silver compounds. Side this that converted into photographic camera and so on. Semiconductors into radio. Semiconductor is an invention, whereas innovation, radio is the innovation. Storage of data on magnetic surface, it's an invention. Whereas magnetic tape, cassette, and diskettes, these are all innovations. Laser technology, it's an invention. CD and DVDs are innovations. And the famous formula by Einstein is equal to MC square is an invention. Whereas nuclear power, converted into nuclear power, it is an innovation. Remember that. We again mess up the things. Creativity and innovation, we think that it is the same thing. But it is not so. Creativity is a thinking of new things. Whereas innovation is doing new things. The doing word is very important in innovation. I'll give a wonderful example example of iPod by Apple. It's a really, really wonderful example. Who is the uh, that time chairperson of uh, Apple, managing uh, CEO of Apple, Steve Jobs. Steve Jobs rebuilt Apple using simple iPod device. A thousand song in the pocket, the name of the device. And what happened exactly within three, four years? Increased revenue more than 1200%. Increased the net profit by more than 3000%. Incre increased market cap more than 35 times to over 300 billion. So it's a really very good success. And that is why you always take the name of Steve Jobs whenever we talk about in innovation. Remember that iPod wasn't the first portable music device. Sony popularized the music anywhere, anytime concept 22 years earlier with what Walkman. The iPod wasn't the first device that put hundreds of songs in your pocket. Dozens of manufacturers had MP3 devices on the market when the iPod was released in 2001. Apple was actually late to the party when it comes to provide an our online music sharing platform like Napstar, Bookstar, Kazaa and all. So iPad was not the first portable music device. It was not the first MP3 player. It was not the first company to make thousands of songs immediately available to millions of users. And what is so great about iPod? Why it has changed the innovation world? What were Apple innovations was that it, ha it has combined all these elements, design, ergonomics, and ease of use in a single device. And then tried it directly into platform that effortlessly kept that device updated with music. Apple invented nothing. So innovation was creating an easy to use ecosystem. This word is very important. Easy to use ecosystem that unified music, music discovery, delivery and device. In the process, they have revolutionized the music industry. One more very important screen and you must remember this screen throughout your life. See the innovation ranking. The first column is innovation ranking. The second column is name of the companies, leading companies in the world. Third column is R&D investment. 
and four column is R and D ranking. It is the old, I think 2011 or 2012, yeah, 2011's diagram. Now you just observe carefully what, what is the greatness of Apple. They have spent just $1.78 billion. Apple has spent $178 billion. They have neglected the R&D rank. It is 70. But they got innovation rank. That is number one. Whereas, compare it with Microsoft. Microsoft, in those years, they have spent $8.71 billion. And what is their innovation rank? Fifth. Means R&D, if you focus more, then you won't get innovation rank and then you cannot lead the market. If you want to build, uh, lead the market, you must come up with the innovation. And that is, that is very, very important. It is now a buzzword today. One more issue, critical thinking and creativity. Always be confused with the innovation. Critical thinking, normally our curriculum is teaching this one. Begin with one problem, that is numerous data, and we'll come up with one answer. But creativity is something different. Begin with problem or question and come up with numerous possibilities. And that is creative thinking. If you compare critical thinking with creative thinking, there are so many attributes on which they are, diff they are, they are saying that they are different. Just observe this one, left brain and right brain. I tick mark this by red color. Critical thinking happened in left brain while creative thinking happened at right brain. So all these things are different. One more issue, creativity, innovation and entrepreneurship. Remember that when you use creativity to develop some product, processes or business model, and if you could succeed in the market, then it is innovation. So intersection of entrepreneurship and creativity is an innovation. What is the difference between employees of developed countries and India? What we are doing, we perceive a degree, nokri and promotion. In developed nation, they pursue patentable, scalable and revolutionary innovation. Normally, the total income from patent is many more times higher than total income from salary. And we never focus on it. And we need it badly for developing our eco economy to become Atma Nirbhar Bharat. Very good examples of innovation. Google search engine, Facebook. No need to tell anybody. Everybody knows about it. I'll, I'd like to show you something else. Micro oven is an innovation. It is an accidental innovation. So innovation, uh, there are two ways of doing innovation. One is accidental innovation. Thousand out of thousand employees, one employee can do it. But whereas uh, there are Russian techniques like trees through which Samsung is uh, enhancing the innovation competencies of the, the, their employee. And now out of 1,000 people, employees, 500 people are doing innovations. So that's why I'm telling you this accidental innovation. I would like to share this incident. It's very interesting. Microwave oven is uh, invented by electronics engineer, Mr. L.C. Spencer. While experimenting with the microwave emitting Megatron device, suddenly the chocolate in his pocket had melted. He got the clue and gave birth to microwave oven. So these are the, this is the example, best example of accidental innovation. Another example, Harry Brerley, a metallurgist, accidentally invented stainless steel. He was experimenting with barrel of guns. In those days, after firing few bullets, the barrel could not fire the bullets with the same efficiency because of the friction of bullets and barrel and a rusting issue. 
after a few months of experiment he found that in a heap of steel scrap in a heap of steel scrap few samples are not rusted and he got the clue it was stainless steel and that is why there is no rusting and that material is very good for parents of the gun so these are the examples of accidental uh, innovations but if you could use a technique russian technique like trees then you can train your employees and they can do more innovations nobody can predict the revolutionary impact of innovations it's a really surprise photocopier by xerox company nobody thought that it will dominate the world mobile phone do you know that at&t predicted just 1 million customers and what is the situation today billions of customers tv new york time that newspaper has predicted that it won't overtake radio and what happened today radio has vanished almost and the tv has replaced it even for computer a machine design everybody thought that it is a machine designed for numerical solution of differential equation and you know what is the situation now the it world has dominated the entire world remember that do we always think that innovation means product innovation but it is not so it can be business innovation it can be process innovation and so that this concept we can apply to our institute and we can in enhance the productivity you say walmart it's a innovation arvind high hospital of tamil nadu wonderful example the fellow he has retired he is a ophthalmologist he has retired at the age of 60 and he thought that he should use his knowledge for the betterment of the society he has started free eye operations and today his group is doing 3800 eye operations daily out of which 20 2800 eye operations free of charge they are manufacturing cheapest uh, lens for eye and exporting to 200 countries and that is why just type the arvind eye hospital in your browser you will find 10 story multiple buildings at in tamil nadu similar case of narana heart clinic nano is one more example of innovation there are 10000 parts in the car he has discussed he has negotiated with every vendor redesigned the part and that is why he could launch his nano by tata in just 1 lakh rupees the cheapest car in the world another example indigo airlines mr aditya ghosh is owner of Indi uh, indigo airlines and it is one of the fastest airlines in the world he has adopted a very innovative business model which is based on huge cost saving through bulk purchasing he has purchased first time 100 planes and after that 300 planes and one more thing interesting thing he has used chocolate fuel saving wing tip device to save the cost of traveling it's a really very innovative experiment and now that is a, one of the leading uh, international airlines friends the ceo of microsoft samsung lg get more than 100 crore salary per annum why is there any connection with innovation yeah there is a connection out of now you see the next diagram a very pretty complicated diagram this shows the ecosystem of innovation ecosystem there are hundreds of factors are required uh, are required to develop this ecosystem and it has directly connection with even supply chain management and that is why from south korea samsung is control even a shop in your town shopkeeper doesn't know who is the owner of samsung where it is situated but the supply chain is properly maintained the innovation chain is properly maintained ecosystem is properly maintained and that is why they are getting 100 crore salary last point i will come to the triple it i said that in the beginning 
to develop innovation in a new city is a, I mean, uh, easy job than research in a new city. What we have done at Kotam, we have established initially the teaching university. Then we have tried to build research university and yeah, we got great success. Then after that, because of PPP model, we have become financially self-sustainable university. Then purposefully, we have developed interdisciplinary university. At every stage we have seen, we have taken care of uh, the interdisciplinary culture we have developed and we are getting the fruits. Lastly, we have built innovation university and all the processes are in parallel. And that's why we could develop a wonderful university and we are getting huge results out of it. And they are, uh, I mean, really amazing results we are getting. It great goes to our team. What we have done, there is a one file at our website, Recruiter's Corner, in which we have, it's around 107 page document where we have highlighted our success. In last three years, we have tried to develop innovation and research activities at university. And you see, we have started with two incubation centers, 35 startups with 36 IPR patents. And within a year, few more incubation centers we are establishing, which will give the boost to our research culture. We have submitted 212 research proposal worth 307 crores. It is all because that innovative culture we are maintaining, which include 30 international proposals in collaboration with 13 countries. More than 70 students back the global coding competition. They have backed the prizes. Our faculty could produce 850 research papers with 25 research papers with UG students. We must develop the culture among even UG courses, innovation culture. Then next experiment was MTech program with work for working professional and we have admitted 122 working professionals from 80 leading IT industries, 80, 80 leading IT industries. And this month we are admitting 50 more. This is possible because we are planning to develop our institute not around departments, but around highly interdisciplinary research groups who are trying to build an innovation culture. And I think that India needed badly. It's an institute of national importance. So we must focus on innovation. Data science is a perfect strategy because it's a highly interdisciplinary subject and I'm sure we can grow our country with this efforts. Thank you very much. Jai Hind.